Hey guys, Tim here, back with a quick unboxing. Well, it's a pretty big unboxing, but actually one of my cheaper unboxings now that I'm thinking about it, um, compared to what I've been doing lately. Um, everything in this was actually not that expensive. Um, it's all figures, and thankfully. Uh, these figures are not expensive figures. They're not scale figures. It's going to be some more pop-up parade figures. Um, we have quite a few of them. Let's see, how am I going to show them off? That was my Bose headphones. Hopefully they didn't break. Uh, Alright. But anyway, we have five figures to show off today. Um, which one is this one? Uh, Urza Scarlet. Um, Grant Magic Games Royale version. We got that one. Let's try to... I guess we're in here for now. Um, let's see here. What's next? We'll try to get this one out. And it is the Wendy Marvel figure. Another pop-up parade. All of these are pop-up parades. That's why the prices were so cheap. But I like these like $30 to $50 figures. It's better than spending two or three hundred dollars for like a a sixth scale or a seventh scale, and like they're the same size and much cheaper. Um, this is uh, Lucy with the Aquarius form. Got that one, um, which matches well with my. Uh, I already have three Papa Pre figures. Um, I already have the Lucy uh, Taurus form. I believe. There's one more for me that is still on pre-order. I believe I got all the ones in stock that I really wanted. Um, still might actually, there's a not and gray one too. I believe they're from the Grand Magic Games. I'd like to get those. And there might be one or two more that's on pre-order for the girls of the series. Like there might be another Lucy one and maybe another Urza one. I'm not exactly sure. It might be Mira Jane, I'm not really sure. Um, but anyway, I'd like to get those one day as well. i like to get all the uh, pop-up parade uh, fairy tale figures and maybe some of the other figures because I think they're really cool. Um, anyway, we have Urz uh, Yoto Benizakra form. We have that one. Put that one with Urza. And we have the last one which is also wrapped up for some reason. It's odd that they would only wrap up one of them. And this is another Lucy one. And we have the Virgo form. So, is there any more Lucy ones coming out? I don't know actually now, because I thought this one was the one that was on pre-order, but apparently I already bought it, so it is clearly not on pre-order. Um, anyway, we have Lucy Virgo form, Lucy Aquarius form, uh, Wendy, uh, just normal form, a uh, couple of Urza figures, and yeah, there we have it. Five new fairy tale figures. Um, don't know if I'll get around to opening these anytime soon. Uh, I haven't actually opened any of my pop up parades. I've just kept them down here in this room. Um, I actually have my uh, IKEA Detolf shelves upstairs, and I haven't been taking my figures up there lately, but I have the two uh, IQ ones. It'd be cool if they release some more. I think they did actually release two more. And we have a Lucy figure. So, six fairy tale figures. Unfortunately, like, whenever fairy tale was ongoing, they didn't release, like, any. There was almost zero fairy tale figures. And now, years later, like a decade after all these series ended, we're finally getting, like, Bleach figures and Naruto figures and fairy tale figures. It's really cool um, that all these things are coming out years past whenever these series were in their prime and ongoing. So, but I'm not complaining, I love these series, and I'm very excited that we're finally getting some figures for them. So I will see you in the next video.